All this month, get any smartphone 32 gig and under for 50% off regular price at Appalachian Wireless. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. While supplies last, two-year agreement required. By a unanimous vote, the Jenkins City Council approved the second reading of the city's packaged alcohol sales ordinance Monday evening. That means packaged alcohol sales, including Sunday sales, could begin soon in the city. City residents voted largely in favor of packaged alcohol sales last summer. Mayor Todd DePriest said public sentiment has largely been favorable toward the sale of alcohol in the city. He said the alcohol sales will ultimately benefit the city by promoting growth as well as helping fund the city's police department. We're trying to relieve some uh, stress we have, I guess, in the general fund. You know, one thing being the police department, it, it's hard to fund the police department. There's no revenue created by a police force, uh, water, sewer, garbage, and those things all have revenue streams coming in that, that help support it. And uh, we're hoping to free up some money in the general fund and uh, be able to pay our policemen and, and uh, possibly hire another one in the near future, depending on how the, the revenue comes in. Now the alcohol ordinance was approved, but there'll be a little bit of time passed between now and the time that alcohol finally begins to be sold here in the city of Jenkins. Any business wishing to sell alcohol here in the city will have to apply with the city and with the state. Prior to the vote last year, DePriest said three businesses in town, Double Quick, Rite Aid, and Dollar General, all expressed interest in alcohol sales. The mayor said one of those businesses has already begun the application process and could be ready to sell packaged alcohol when the ordinance is published in Letcher County's newspaper of record, The Mountain Eagle. So that'll, that'll finalize making the ordinance in force. And, uh, then uh, it'll be up to the license and when the license comes through the individual businesses and then, then they'll be able to sell after that. The Jenkins Alcohol Ordinance is expected to be published in the Mountain Eagle either this week or next week. Reporting in Jenkins for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.